Hey everybody, what's up? This is Rich. Uh, what I have here is a Mozilla Firefox web browser. It is version 2.0.0.12. This is the current version of the browser at the time of this writing. And right now, it is taking up a memory usage of 22,708K. When you start Firefox blank like this, that's what it should take up. Maybe it's a little less, maybe it's a little more, depending on your system. This is uh, Windows XP Service Pack 2, by the way. Uh, it should be somewhere between 17,000 and 25,000K. Uh, part of the problem with the Firefox browser, at least with version 2, is that it, be, it turns out to be a huge memory sucker whenever you load up pages that have intensive flash, and I'll show you what I mean by that. If I go to Ustream.tv and load that web page up, twice. Just wait till it loads here. Okay, let me just mute that and mute this one. The memory usage has jumped to 73,928K. And uh, it just jumped to 74. I'll probably go to 75. That's just huge and that is because Ustream happens to be a site that has a ton of uh, flash intensive stuff. Now if I open up some regular web pages besides that I'll do uh, Google, Yahoo, and MSN.com so I have them all open in tabs here. The memory usage is now 84,068K. Now you'll see that the CPU usage is not that high. It goes from 0 to 10 depending on what the browser is doing at the time. But the, the fact of the matter is, is that Firefox in its current state is just really chunky as far as the memory usage is concerned. And hopefully with Firefox 3 they'll be able to alleviate some of this. And if you didn't think that for whatever reason Firefox was a, uh, a memory hog. All you have to do is go to Google and search for Firefox memory leak like this and uh, right here at the Mozilla Zine which is Mozilla Foundation website it says reducing memory usage and how to do it. And if we read on that really quick it says, for most users, Firefox doesn't use an abnormally large amount of memory. For other users, however, Firefox memory consumption is a major problem. So they do admit it. It is a problem. It says the article discusses how to lower Firefox's memory consumption. If you want to check out this page, again, you just go to Google and you search for Firefox memory leak. It's the first web page that comes up. Uh, they also note, I don't know if it's on this page uh, specifically, but in the beta version of Firefox 3 right now they actually have this thing called uh, RAMBAC. If I actually go to Google and search for Firefox RAMBAC that's actually an add-on and it's only for version 3 in the beta it's not for version 2. I wish it was for version 2 but it's not. As you can see here it's uh, for Firefox 3.0 alpha to 3.0 beta 2 and uh, says Ramback will cause Firefox to issue an internal notification to free up memory that is otherwise held for performance purposes. Additional items will be hooked into this notification in the future. And this was released relatively recently. is November 7th, 2007, a couple of months ago. So, yeah, you can do that with Firefox 3, but not with Firefox 2. And uh, just by letting this sit as it is, I'm up to 93,344 uh, K of mem usage. I mean, this is just ridiculous. It's the most used memory uh, for an app in my system right now. Quite ridiculous, but that's unfortunately the way the Firefox browser works. So hopefully this is going to be fixed in uh, version 3, which uh, should hopefully be released pretty soon, but in case you're ever wondering why does Firefox have memory problems, well, Mozilla admits it themselves. So now you know, and when version 3 comes out, hopefully it'll be a whole lot better. Take it easy.